So right now it is the end of day eight. Um, I got the wiring done in the sedan. Um, I got all the wiring out and I've replaced with all the wagon wiring. Uh, it's like four in the morning. I just finished soldering the connectors that I fucked the shit out of. Uh, pulling them out of the wagon, where the fuck they are. I don't know, here they are. You can kind of see. Um, they're all fucking taped up. I soldered these. Um, I couldn't get these to unplug when I tried pulling this harness out of the wagon. Not realizing that I'd actually need this harness, so I just cut them all. Um, bad idea. I probably spent two hours using the uh, PDF version of the Volvo Green Book, figuring out which wire goes to where, and uh, twisting, soldering, taping. So that was fun. Uh, probably wouldn't have taken me two hours to actually unplug them. Probably would have taken me maybe like two minutes. So uh, a waste of an hour, 58 minutes. But yep, got the passenger side all put back together, sort of, kind of-ish. Um, I'm not putting the floor back together yet as my power wire for my back battery and my subwoofers is designed, you cannot see shit over there, is uh, only the length to reach to the naturally inspired battery location. I have an extra like three feet wound up in the trunk that I'm just gonna push forward so I can reach it to the driver's side uh, battery location. Um, all the wires are hooked up underneath the uh, dash except for this one wire here that you can't see because my hands in the way and shadows it is uh, seven six six wires that go into the firewall that I was not able to trace I checked before I cut them and it's the same six wires on the naturally inspired and the turbo so I cut it as close to the connector on the or as close to the grommet on the naturally inspired as I could and as close to the firewall grommet as I could on the turbo so that way I have like twice the length to work with tomorrow I'm just going to strip twist solder um, tape and then I will be all good to put the driver's side dash back together and shit. And then I will start bringing the wires forward. I didn't bring, you cannot see crap over here, holy crap. Um, that's a lot of crap. Does this help? That helps a little bit. You can see I have the wires just dangling on the side over there. Um, and they're dangling over there also. I haven't run any of the wires forward yet. Once I do that, I'm gonna have to re-hook up my fog lights, run the power wires and the relays over to the driver's side. Uh, battery switching the location is added quite a bit of time. Um, I'll get it done. Still waiting on that uh, filter from FCP Groton. It shipped out early this morning, coming from Connecticut to New Hampshire again. So it should be here tomorrow, hopefully. If it's not, I will be sitting on my hands until it comes hopefully Friday so I can put the engine in and just plug in the five plugs on the engine harness. Um, I want to go to Six Flags on Friday. So I would, I would really like the car to be done so I can go there in the morning with my girlfriend, her brother, and her brother's girlfriend, um, some friends and shit. So, yep. Uh, four in the morning. I'm gonna go to bed now. Um, I've kind of can't even stand. I'm so tired. So I will see you tomorrow.